This is St. Helena, James Bay. The town is over there and you can't see it because it goes up the canyon there. You can see the overlap. Lots of birds flying against that cliff, uh, turns. Pretty neat place to live. Sunset, the North Atlantic Ocean. This isn't a harbor, uh, it's just an indentation um, on the lee side of the island. When I was here in 1988, there were no moorings and there wasn't a ferry service. Uh, those changes are out here, ashore, this place hasn't changed at all, although there's an airport that's been built and it was supposed to open last year. But they built it on the windward side of the island, right on the edge of those cliffs. And any sailor, any pilot would know that when the trade winds hit those cliffs, they're going to accelerate upward and they create turbulence that's made landing and takeoffs for the airport dangerously impossible. I mean, it's possible, but not, it's too dangerous. And so they've spent $300 million for this airport. And a lot of local residents, there are 4,000 people who live on this island full time. And I'm glad it hasn't changed, but if you lived here, you were going to make some money off of tourism and a lot of people spent money in that expectation. Uh, the man who runs the ferry boat bought a bigger boat as well, planning to run dive tours and that kind of thing. Well, this is one of the few places in the world where the 4,000 people who live here all know each other. They see an unfamiliar face, they know you sailed here on your own and they are charmingly friendly. I like this place a lot.